This is a eucalyptus tree. Commonly found in such places as Brazil and Australia, the eucalyptus tree is known for it being highly flammable, having an insatiable thirst for groundwater, and destroying all surrounding plant life due to its invasiveness. In Brazil, eucalyptus plantations are known as green deserts because they do not allow anything else to live. Massive wildfires in Australia earlier this year were fueled by eucalyptus trees, traveling faster than 60 miles per hour, killing hundreds of people. Additionally, eucalyptus trees contain a fungus that, when inhaled, causes fatal meningitis in both people and animals. This is International Paper. This corporation owns a genetic research facility called Arborgen. Arborgen recently took eucalyptus trees from Brazil, genetically altered them in a New Zealand laboratory, and created eucalyptus trees that produce higher levels of cellulose. The more cellulose a eucalyptus tree has, the more ethanol can be rendered, and international paper makes more money. And now international paper wants to plant their franken trees in the United States. The problem is that the American ecosystem has never been exposed to eucalyptus trees. And given that these trees will be allowed to flower and produce seeds, the ecosystem is being threatened with extinction by this aggressive plant. This is the United States Department of Agriculture, who rubber-stamped the proposal in May 2009, opening America's doors to 260,000 eucalyptus trees. For more information, please visit nogetrees.org.